Welcome back everyone to Foxtech. If you're tired of seeing all your photos and videos automatically appear on your iPad, even though you took them on your iPhone or downloaded them on your Mac, then this video is for you. Today, I'll show you exactly how to stop this from happening by managing your iCloud settings. So if your photos are showing up on your iPad when you didn't intend for them to, it's likely because iCloud synchronization is turned on iCloud is a service that automatically syncs your photos and videos across all devices that are logged in with the same Apple ID. While this can be convenient for some, I know it can also be a bit frustrating if you prefer to keep your device's media separate. Fortunately, turning off the synchronization is easy and I'm going to walk you through the steps to do just that. First, open the settings app on your iPad. At the very top of the settings menu, you'll see your name. Go ahead and tap on it to access your Apple ID settings. This is where you manage all things related to your account, including iCloud. Once you're in the Apple ID section, tap on iCloud. Here you'll find a variety of options related to cloud storage and synchronization. This is the control center for all your cloud related settings. Now, when it comes to photos, you'll see an option called photos within the iCloud settings. This is where the magic happens. Um, in my case, um, I prefer to have um, iCloud photos completely disabled. I find it a bit um, annoying to deal with, uh, so none of the devices in my network use iCloud photos. However, I understand that you might want to keep your iPhone backed up to iCloud in terms of photos while stopping the sync specifically on your iPad. Thankfully, you have the flexibility to do just that. To stop your iPad from automatically receiving photos, you simply need to disable the option labeled sync this device. Once this is turned off, you can rest assured that photos taken on your iPhone or other devices won't randomly show up on your iPad anymore. It's a quick and effective way to keep your media where you want it. However, there's one more thing to keep in mind. After you disable this option, only the photos stored locally on your iPad will remain. If you already have some photos in your gallery that were synced to iCloud, they will disappear from your iPad once you turn off this feature. Those photos will still be safe in iCloud, but they won't be visible on your iPad anymore. Thanks for watching. I hope this video helped you regain control over where your photos are stored and displayed. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to Fox Tech for more tech tips and tutorials. See you guys later.